All right, so Calvin, just kind of talk about how you kind of settled in uh, this year to kind of maybe take on more of a featured role. Uh, I mean, I've been, like I said, I got to thank the good Lord first because without him, it would be possible. I've been working hard in the offseason, getting my body prepared, getting in shape, getting bigger, working on my pass protection. You and I talked last spring or last or end of last season. You were saying you know, it was obviously frustrating to have you know your red shirt taken. How did you kind of like over in the off season approach it, kind of with a positive mindset of wanting to know? Positive mind. Yeah. Well, I was looking at it as like, well, I got the experience, right. so I'm gonna just use that experience for, sure. for next year. So it's just learning, just watching what the running back did before me, like Ryan Nall, Thomas, Trey Johnson, all of them were good role models. AP too, just looking up to them, watching them play. If you were to show or tell Oregon State fans, what's different from the Calvin Tyler they saw against maybe Colorado State compared to maybe now? What's different? Uh, what have you worked grown on? Grown man. <laughs> grown man. See, my first game in Colorado State, I was like the nervousness in me. I mean, I was still ready to play, but this year I'm, I'm approaching it as a grown man, ready to, ready to uh, get physical and play fast. How do you like uh, Coach Petrie and what has he brought to the uh, running back group? He brought a lot of uh, confidence to all of us. You know? like, we all play, play good under Coach Petrie. I mean, he teaches teaches the right thing. Everything we use, everything we use, we go out there and use it in, in a scrimmage or our practice. So it's good things going on right now. How do you like the running ground back group as a whole? You know, you guys lost a lot, like you said, Thomas, uh, Travoris, Ryan, so on. But you bring back still a lot of bodies, just not quite experienced. How do you think that will blend this year? Uh, it blend well because we reload it. <laughs> we all like reload it. Like we all can run that ball from from AP on down to uh, Hunter Max, and we all can run the ball this year. And for you, as you kind of start to settle into being more of like that featured role, uh, is there any more that you guys have a group that kind of had to do collectively leadership-wise, knowing that those older guys aren't in the room anymore to kind of yes, be like, that lean on? Yes, sir. It's crazy. I'm glad you asked that. Uh, today, Coach Petrie, well, last night, well, around 4.30 in the morning, Coach Petrie's baby was born. Oh, so wow. Coach Petrie was in that practice oh, my. today. Oh, so okay. Coach Trotz took, took the spot and me and AP and BJ, we all, all the running backs actually led each drill. Got How through that. Even better. Sounds good. When do you get to go see Coach Petrie's uh, uh, little? As, probably as soon as I uh, lead this interview.